everybody so i hope that you went ahead and you watched part one as to how i made this mask now here is part two on my makeup my face makeup so first i'm going to take the mask and then i am going to take a concealer which is a little lighter than my skin tone and i'm going to use this to trace around the mask just so i know where exactly the good part is going to be Then I'm going to go in with my foundation and I'm going to place it around the outside of the mask. Taking my beauty blender, I'm just going to blend that foundation in. This is just regular school glue and I'm going to place it on the outline of the mask. Then I'm going to take a paintbrush and I'm just going to kind of paint that, blend out the glue. Next I'm going to take some torn pieces of paper and this is tissue paper, you can use tissue paper, toilet paper, whatever you want and I'm going to place this along the outline of the mask. So here I'm just taking the end of, tool of the, not toothbrush, the paintbrush and I'm just lifting up the edges and this is because I really want this to look like if it is skin lifting up. call this a glue stick yeah and I am just applying this to my eyebrows because I want to cancel out my eyebrows basically I don't want to have any eyebrows any appearance of eyebrows so I'm using my glue stick to cover my eyebrows then I'm going in with my foundation from before and I'm covering this with my beauty blender foundation but you're gonna see I'm gonna go in later with a foundation that is a little darker and I'm placing this along the tissue of the mask with some setting powder and this is a shade that's close to my skin tone and I'm setting my eyebrows then I'm going in with some foundation and I'm placing that on my eyelids going in with the powder now I am just going to place this over my eyelids Now I'm taking a black eyeliner pencil and I'm just creating a winged eyeliner. Lashes, false eyelashes to the top lids, and now I'm just going in with some mascara to the bottom eyelashes. 
going in with a dark plum kind of color lip liner and I'm outlining my lips. Then I'm going in with a red matte lipstick and I'm filling in my lips. Then I'm going in with, I'm going to use actually three different liquid lipsticks and this is going to create dimension and help it look more realistic and I'm just taking a paintbrush and I'm brushing all in my mask and then I'm also going to brush it on the outside of my mask as well And I'm just taking some brown hair gel here and this is really going to create the dimension that we want. And I'm placing this just wherever randomly along the mask inside where the flesh area is on my face. going in with the liquid lipstick from before and I'm just making this drip so it looks like if it's blood dripping down so I really hope that you enjoy this tutorial if you have please don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up and if you haven't already subscribe to my channel so until next time bye bye